Welcome to another episode of You Try Now, the Rapid Fire Restaurant Review. To celebrate the movie Chef being released on Netflix streaming, we're trying Cuban sandwiches from across the country. Up first is Chiano's in Campbell, California. For an appetizer, we tried the chopped salad. The cornbread for croutons was a nice touch, but it was otherwise nothing special. Their Cuban sandwich, El Jefe Torta, included a fried egg, which was slimy goodness. The bacon was crispy and not overpowering. Unfortunately, the black bean spread left an unpleasant aftertaste, but adding the jalapeno on the side improved all of the other flavors. So, should you try now? Despite the salad and bean spread, yes. Next, we head to New York and try Sophie's. The Cubano had all the right combination of ingredients, not too sour, had a good amount of spice, and the green hot sauce enhances it even further. The distribution of ham and pork could have been better, but overall it was a tasty sandwich. So, should you try now? Yes. And finally, we head back to California and try the werewolf in San Diego. The atmosphere is a bit too loud, but the service is really friendly. The papa balls had a pleasant texture, crunchy on the outside and soft on the inside. The sauce was tangy and went well with the bits of cheese and bacon. The pork belly in the belly cubano was tender, and the mustard was a great compliment. The cheese was perfectly melted, but the pickles were too strong and dominated the sandwich. As soon as we removed some of the pickles, it was much better. Also, the side of french fries tasted like they were frozen. So, should you try now? Despite the pickles and fries, yes. Until next time, thanks for watching You Try Now.